What is good, YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, wherever else this is going? Um, I'm Denzel. Nice to meet you guys. You know, um, I'm here at my stop making faces. <laughs> I'm here at David's house. Yo, yeah, and I've come across a poem that I wrote last year, November. Um, about it's called Merry Xmas. And I haven't memorized the poem yet, to be honest. I haven't even, like, got the flow of the poem down. So, personally, this is just a fair warning to you that whatever I'm about to do right now on camera <laughs> may not be professional, but whatever, you know. I'll put the lyrics, the poem, in the description so you can just read it. And before I even say the poem, I have, like, two things to say about it. First of all, like I said, I wrote it last year, November, so... It's not the best poem or whatever, but um, it was like before I knew what Merry Xmas meant. And second of all, like I said, before it was before I knew what Merry Xmas meant, but I still feel that even though X may mean or does mean Christ in Greek, not everybody knows that. So like, will it kill you just to put those C-H-R-I-S-T there? You know, like keep the Christ in Christmas. And as everybody else is saying now, keep the Christ in Christians too. So, yeah. I'm going to stop talking now and start talking again with this poem. And, you know, enjoy. Merry Xmas by Denzel Munson. Born in a manger made of wood to be killed on a cross made of wood. Suffered the ultimate levels of pain on the behalf of those he created. And not once did he complain leaving his perfect home in heaven and diving into the deepest depths of hell so as to keep us, the very people who murdered him in the process from ever having to witness the treacherous experiences that awaited us there. And still, we place an X where his name is supposed to be. How would you feel if on your very birthday, a day celebrating your birth, you had your name X'd out and having Satan, I mean Santa, excuse my dyslexia, receive more attention than you do? Some say he wasn't born on that day, so they see no point to this respect we are asked to pay. So it is ironically those same people who neglect him all year as well, placing an X not only of the place of his name, but an opportunity he gives them to escape from hell, not knowing that for every X they replace his name with, an X replaces their own name in the book of life. A chosen but a corrupted generation trying to keep God out of the earth. But see, you can't kick the creator out of his own creation, people. It is he who continues the cycle of birth. Without him, what is your life worth? Looking forward to presents that you can't take to heaven yet. You don't even know that heaven itself sent you the greatest gift anyone could ever give. You've been too busy placing an X on it to realize. And without that, your superficial gifts will continue to bring you superficial happiness, which will drain quickly by superficial needs and disappointments because you never had the true gift of life. Grow up. You're playing with toys. And like I said, I know that X represents Christ or whatever, but not everybody knows that. And so, will it kill you just to keep the Christ in Christmas? And that's all I have to say about this. So, yeah. Bye. You want to say bye? No, nah, you're good. He's a grouch. <laughs> bye. <laughs>